Plenty of changes to tell you about. Jeff Hoffman here from the UF Weather Center. First, let's look at the change that happened Friday. We warmed up. We were 5 to 10 degrees warmer than we were the day before. The humidity has come up as well. Notice on my muggy meter that dew point, which is a measure of the moisture in the air, was at 64. That was higher than the 50s we had earlier this week, and we're going into the 70s by Sunday and Monday before it drops again next Tuesday. We've got a big front on the way. So here are my three big things. There's a lot going on, so pay attention. Saturday's the best day for outdoor activities, although Sunday's still not bad. There just may be a few showers in the area. Then the strong front gets here Monday night, so probably most of Monday. Warm and breezy and humid. Thunderstorms could be strong on Monday night, and then a big chill is on the way. The coolest air so far this season, the coolest since April. Daytime highs may not hit 70 in some spots, and the overnight lows on my sixth day, yeah, they're headed for the 40s. Certainly not 40s on the map for your Saturday morning if you're up early for a bike ride or some early morning tennis or golf. It's going to be nice. Temperatures in the 60s, although you'll feel the humidity by afternoon. We'll see a high between 85 and 87 with a generally sunny sky. Let me zoom out here a bit, though, for sun. Sunday, you can see some moisture coming in off the Atlantic. There may be some showers Sunday afternoon. The temperatures keep climbing near 90 in Tampa. And then I want to draw your attention to the left side of your screen here. That's the big front that will bring strong thunderstorms to the panhandle Monday afternoon. We're still warm and generally dry, but those storms will be on our doorstep Monday night into Tuesday morning. Also, take note, the jet stream is allowing Canadian air to spill across the border all the way down into the south and east, and it's going to hang here for a couple of days. This is certainly a shot of some almost early winter like temperatures. It's going to last for about two, two and a half days. Here's my updated six day. There you can see the nice weekend, but then changes start Monday and notice that 47 by Thursday morning.